Hey guys, what's up? It's Ayush Mantu from It's Yellow Thing. Uh, so it's a very uh, moment to rejoice as the Amazon OS 12 is uh, launched and is available as an update for the Eureka phones as well after rolling out for the OnePlus One. So many people are asking how to update as the OTA update slightly gets delayed. For the OnePlus One, it's not available yet as of on the through the OTA actual OTA on the phones and also uh, on U forums Rahul Sharma said that it would take at least three days to update but we have a good news also the official update is available to download through the official Sanogen servers and we have the link so uh, you can download it and flash it 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 is completely official you the same it is the same thing either you update through the uh, ota from the phone update section or through uh, flashing the update from uh, cyanogen recovery uh, you won't be needing to root your phone neither you need to unlock bootloader nothing stuff like that only a simple copy paste and then rebooting to uh, recovery mode and then flashing the update so we are going to see how to do that uh, before that make sure you have an, a, a backup of your phone though it's not needed you are not going to uh, completely uh, wipe your phone or wipe your media all the things will remain same your apps and everything just for the sake of uh, peace of mind you should take backup so if in, in case anything goes wrong you can still get you will still have your data safe so make sure you have the backup and now the first thing you need to download is the uh, update file itself so the link is in the description and I will also put some mirrors so in case this uh, official Sanogen server goes down due to heavy downloading you can still download it from the mirrors it's the same file official file the link as you can see it's start from builds.cyngn.com it's the official link you can download it's a 640 something kind of MB of file a very small file you can download it within minutes if you have the 3G data or broadband connection with high speed so I have already downloaded the file uh, I'm not having the Eureka with me myself but I'm going to uh, demonstrate the procedure through my OnePlus One and it is a, a, a fully uh, same thing so I have my OnePlus One here it's connected to the PC as you can see uh, after uh, downloading the file you just need to go to the files and um where is it yeah so the file will look like some it will look something like this cm-12.0-yng1 tas 0 dash yng one tas 0 w 0 dash tomato dot sign uh, dash sign dot zip so it's a zip file don't open it it will remain as zip and you need to copy it and you need to go to the phone uh, in your case it will be a50 something and go to the internal storage and paste it here itself as you can see here I have copied it into my internal memory here so that is that is it that is the only part you have to do now you need to go to the phone uh, disconnect it from the PC if you have the advanced developer options activated and you have the advanced reboot section uh, if you know how to do that in the settings you can go to the recovery mode directly from here or if you don't know how to do that just switch off your phone I will show you how to do that in the other way so after turning it off you will need to press the volume down button which will be in the left side of the phone and the power button which will be in the right side of the phone and then it will vibrate just leave it for a moment it in this case it's one plus but you will need it will show you the u of course and here is the cyanogen recovery it will be exactly the same as you can see here there are many options don't touch anything just click on the second option which is apply update then there will be two option apply from adb or choose from internal storage then choose the internal storage then go to the zero dash uh, it can be other thing uh, you can find the file you are going to need this is the cm12 uh, this is the file you need to update click on that it will start installing the system update and after a few minutes you will get your Sanogen updated 
so i will show you the demonstration of cyanogen and a deep review of the cyanogen 12 os both on the oneplus one and eureka very soon we are working on it uh, this was the quick video on how to update the U eureka and you can take it of course for oneplus one also if you know uh, the file i will also put the link for the oneplus one as well on in the link below description below so thanks guys for watching do share and subscribe See ya.